It's time to go inside the huddle. Glenn Clark for SFMSports.net alongside Stevenson women's lacrosse coach Kathy Raley. Coach, good to see you. You too. Big part of the year. Important, sure important is. couple of games, we hope, coming up here. Which one hasn't been? <laughs> yeah, that's a good point, though. That is a very good point. Uh, obviously, tomorrow we will be uh, playing conference tournament action mm-hmm. and a pretty big rematch uh, against a team that you just saw recently. Sure. Um, I expect this to be the game that uh, really rewards the toughest set of girls, uh, the most aggressive, the smartest, and the toughest. You were able to win the first one. Sure. This is going to be a little bit different. There's mm-hmm. some personnel things going on on both sides. Right. How, how much did you learn from that first matchup that you're going to take into this one? Well, I think that we held Lebanon Valley uh, in a good, really good defensive plan in the first half uh, without Rachel Akshar, which was – uh, that's pretty key when one of your top defenders is out Absolutely. and you have to make some adjust adjustments. I think it was just a few minutes, um, maybe the day before uh, the game, the, the, the time that we saw them. So um, we made those adjustments. We held a very good team to seven goals. So I'm very proud of that. Uh, offensively, we really slowed down in the second half and stopped going for the jugular. We're going to really need to improve in that in, in this game. You're coming out of a Widener game where you scored 15, <laughs> but you gave up 14. <laughs> Um, you know, for those of us that weren't there on Saturday, kind of take us through that. At the end of the day, you won, and that's sort of all that mattered because you locked up the two sure. seed. But what what happened on Saturday? Why mm-hmm. did, were they able to score so many goals? Well, it was a 10 to 2 first half. And when, when you have such a, a route in the first 30 minutes, I think a lot of players stopped playing so hard. Mm-hmm. Um, we started fouling, and, and the fouling gets us in trouble and has consistently got us into trouble this year. So, uh, same thing happened against Lebanon Valley the last time we played them. We had, I think, 10 fouls in the first half and then 14 or 15 in the second half we can't keep putting teams up on the eight meter mark yeah. um and sending them one v maggie and that's not fair to maggie and right. we're going to get a little bit better at that we're going to work a lot on that today i think we have a really good defensive game plan for tomorrow it's all going to come down to whether or not the attack finishes what they're supposed to finish which is put the ball in the cage everything that your team has been through this season mm-hmm. the the injuries the you know players not being there the the tough start to the season right. and then a really good you know stretch of the conference sure. play how prepared do you believe they are for now one and done lacrosse they don't want tomorrow to be the last day so they are feeling pretty tough it will be a matter of Lebanon Valley is an emotionally tough team they come out strong um, we can get in their heads quite quickly but we have to dominate both ends of the field and we have to be smart Maggie's going to need to p- make some key saves early in the game to kind of show them that she's on Defensively, we're going to have to not foul and have great footwork and execute the game plan. Offensively, we're going to need to go with possession time while still being aggressive. And those are two things that we've had difficulty Mm -hmm. uh, really understanding this year is that we can possess and still go to goal. We just don't have to shoot an out-of-angle shot or force a pass to the middle um, and turn the ball over. So we're looking forward to that chance to really show that we have matured in, in this season. Well, it's tomorrow afternoon, 4 o'clock Wednesday, depending on when you're watching this, Wednesday afternoon at 4 o'clock, right here at Mustang Stadium, Matt Commonwealth Conference semifinal yeah. as Stevenson plays host to Lebanon Valley. Coach, go get them, and Great. hopefully we'll be talking about a uh, conference championship I the next time so. you and I chat. For more about Stevenson women's lacrosse, go to GoMustangSports.com. I'm Glenn Clark, inside the huddle for SFMSports.net.